on the 15th of October, the National Economic Council meeting of uh, the governors and all the others uh, directed the immediate establishment of state-based judicial panels of inquiry across the country to receive and investigate complaints of police brutality or related extrajudicial killings with a view to delivering justice for all victims of the dissolved SARS and other police units. The panel will include representatives of youth, students, civil society organizations, <clears throat> and will also be chaired by a respected retired state high court judge. The panel will have six months to complete its assignment. And the National Executive Council took other decisions, Economic Council took other decisions. One, that state governors, governors and the FCT minister should take charge of interface and contact with the protesters in their respective domains. And we've seen in a number of states that the governors have reached out to protesters. Secondly, that state governors should immediately establish state-based special security and human rights committees to be chaired by the governors in their states and to supervise the newly formed police tactical units and all other security agencies located in the states. This will ensure the protection of citizens' human rights and the members will also include representatives of youth and civil society, as well as the head of police tactical units in each of the states. Then also the NEC directed the establishment by the Special Committee on Security and Human Rights of a human rights public complaints team of between two to three persons to receive complaints on an ongoing basis. That team would be established by the Special Committee on Security and Human Rights. And um, state governors, it goes on, to immediately establish a victim's fund to enable the payment of monetary compensation to deserving victims. So this is to show that right from the president down to the executive heads of all the states, uh, the inspector general of police at the federal level and at the state level have embraced the demands of the uh, NSAS uh, uh, movement and have moved, are moving very quickly towards the uh, implementation of, uh, of that. And that is the federal uh, government's response.